people, it's your girl T and I'm back again. This is another um, book that I um, received today, Friday. And um, just like I stated in the last video, um, you know, I'm going to be giving up a book to add this one to my stash because this book is beautiful. Um, so the book that I'm going to be giving up for this one is Incredible Insect Designs, Creative Haven Book. I'm giving this one up. I've had it for almost two years. I have not colored one page in this book. Oh, yes, I, I take that back. I have colored one. One page only. One page. So uh, this is going to be given up because I don't see myself coloring in this book. And uh, so therefore, it will be donated or I will just give it to somebody, a friend, or get to get someone into coloring, just pass it out to somebody <laughs> randomly. All right, so the book that I'm adding is Circle Portraits, coloring book by Laura Rafferty. Um, and it came with this cute little bookmark, if you want to call it. Um, I wish I had the dimensions of this book. Uh, let, let me put it up against. Now, here's a Creative Haven book. And if you can see, it's not as long, so it's less than 11 inches in length, but it's wider than eight inches, see? So it's a nice square. It's probably like a, I wanna say maybe a 10 by 10. Yeah, probably by, like a 10 by 10 size. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and start flipping through this. You guys, this book is gorgeous. Now I have peeked and looked, but I have not, I just like flipped through it like, you know. So here is the book. So basically, Circle portraits, all of the portraits you're going to see are inside of a circle. Um, and that's, I, you know, that's why they're called circle portraits. But um, they're all single-sided. So I'm going to go ahead and flip through this for you guys. The paper is nice quality. Um, it's kind of thick here, thick paper. Again, it's single-sided, so you can use markers. What I like about this book is that there is so much diversity. Um, there's people of all nationalities, or many nationalities in this book. And so, you know, I like to support books that like to be inclusive. So, this is a really nice book, guys. It almost is like, it almost kind of reminds you of Grayscale in some of the um, shading. So that's also helpful if you like grayscale um, because then you can, you know, use your grayscale skills here. <laughs> I think this is absolutely beautiful. I love that. Look at this, you guys. I love this, this ring. So the circle is the ring. Look at how beautiful that is. So I gotta practice coloring gems. <laughs> that's something I've been working on this week is coloring stones and gems. Um, and then we have like men in the book, you guys. Look at that. We have a man in here. Look at this. This is like steampunk style. This is so cute. Guys, this book is so cute. I love all the images in here. We have another, another guy, looks like a little kid, maybe, or a teenager. And this is so adorable. The mommy holding her baby, kissing him. That is so cute, you guys. And then this looks like a stopwatch, maybe. Yeah, it looks like a stopwatch. Because you can see the time here. And then here's the, where you wind up the stopwatch. That's so cool. Look at his, look at his stubble, you guys. She drew that stubble so well. Now to make sure it shows up when you color it. Uh, I think it'll be all right, but that is so cool. I love that. Just great art. All this hand, beautiful hand-drawn art.
Look, you even have an elderly man. I think this is so cool, you guys. It's like everyone in the book. <laughs> old, young, old, young, man, woman. I love this image. I love this. I can see her with red hair. Now, I do want to tell you guys, that this book is not perforated. Uh, looks like it is sewn in as well, but it's like it has a different kind of stitching. It's really close together. Looks like if you if you broke the binding, you could probably rip these pages out, but you may not want to do that. I don't like doing that. <laughs> so it looks like it might have an issue with laying flat, um, but we'll see. I'll... It's really tight, so I don't want to do that just now. If I have to go take it to get uh, spiral bound, that's fine, because I'll still have it in book form. <laughs> get some winter pictures. Isn't that pretty? Look at that. This is just an amazing art. They're starting to create some beautiful coloring books for us. Absolutely beautiful. I love this page. And this has to be a mermaid or maybe someone swimming. You can make her into a mermaid if you wanted to by putting some scales on her face drawing some scales down her neck, part of her neck, and down into this area. Oh, look at that face. Oh my gosh, you guys. I love this page. I love it. I love it. These are some awesome, awesome pages. It's another great book. Look at this, guys. Gosh. I like this. It's a peephole. The ship peep. I don't know if it's called a peephole. I don't know what it's called on a ship. <laughs> a window. Ship window. How about that? A ship window. <laughs> oh, look at that. How sweet. That is so nice. I love this book. So sweet. Some really awesome work in here. And every page is nice. You know, every single page. Oh gosh, look at this. Look at this, you guys. Oh, that is so darling. I love this. I love this. This is so beautiful. I love this book. Oh, I think he's supposed to be, this is a rival realm, so he's traveling. You could color him out, you could make him a, color him like a, an Italian would look. That is so cool. I love this page. And I love the way that it's drawn here. It's beautiful. Oh, look at it. So cute. You guys, this book is so cute. This book is available on Amazon, so I'll... In the description, I'm sorry, yeah, in the description below, I'll leave a link to the book if you're interested. So here you get some face elements, bits of portraits for practice shading. So she gives you different eyes, note different noses, mouths, ears, and hair, even different textures of hair to practice before you go into the book so and then on this side here let me scoot this over so you can see on this side you get skin tone sketches so there are many circle portraits for color experiments so to color different skin tones see different nationalities ethnicities so you can practice the skin tones okay so you guys this is another book I was happy to add to my collection. 
And as you can see, there are 42, ooh, there are 42 illustrations, and this is called Color Portraits. Now look guys, I opened the book up, and this is a black cover, and it's already um, like made a crease and taken the color off. Um, that's not gonna hurt, that doesn't bother me, but that might bother someone else. So in this case, if you don't like seeing that, this would probably be a book that you would go get, um, you know, um, put into a spiral. Okay, but there you guys have it. Circle Portraits Coloring Book by Laura Rafferty. All right, y'all, if you like the video, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. And if you have not subscribed, please go ahead and do that by clicking the red subscribe button below. All right, y'all, till next time, take care.